Good evening and welcome to Millennium Stage. And now, please welcome to the stage Ruth Sorensen, the interim chair of the Washington Performing Arts Gospel Programs Committee. Thank you. I want to welcome you to this holiday concert that celebrates the spirit of the season. Our choir will be led by artistic director Michelle Fallon and guest director Dr. Thomas Tyler, who have prepared a treat for you with arrangements of some holiday favorites while leading you in a medley of holiday sing-alongs, so get ready. We want to thank you for coming out to support our young choir, and we especially want to acknowledge our partners here at the Kennedy Center and the staff of Millennium Stage for hosting our program today. The Washington Performing Arts staff, and especially our supporters, Tom Gallagher, Jacqueline Badger Mars, and Mars Incorporated, Beach Street Foundation, and Mr. Jeffrey Bauman, and Ms. Linda Feinberg, Hubert Hank Schlossberg and the Schlossberg family, Reginald Van Lee, the Dan Cameron Family Foundation, and Bruce Rosenblum and Lori Leitman for making today's performance possible. Something magical happens when you hear young people sing together in song, and our young gospel choir is no different. For 25 years, the Children of the Gospel Choir has been a spotlight in community, sharing the splendor of gospel music to audiences of all ages. And if you know a young person between the ages of 9 and 18 who loves to sing, feel free to encourage them to audition. We would love to have them. And you can find more information about auditions uh, at our table as you exit, or you can visit our website at WashingtonPerformingArts.org. We're serious about that. You can also take a little piece of the choir with you by purchasing our CD, Why Do We Sing? featuring the men, women, and children of the gospel choirs. And they are also available at our table. And you will not be uh, sorry if you uh, uh, purchase it. So please, stop at the table. Uh, now, please welcome children of the gospel choir and enjoy this holiday concert.
Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. Oh, it is a delight to be, be here with you all this evening. That was Miss Kalita Betancourt. Will you just give her another round of applause? Thank you. My name is Michelle Fallon. I am the artistic director of this phenomenal group, Children of the Gospel. That first selection was entitled Doxology. And next, uh, in the program, I believe it kind of follows the order of what we're doing. If not, I'm going to shout out to you all this evening what will be happening. The Ukrainian uh, Carol, Carol of the Bells. So one of the things that I always like to share whenever we do gospel concerts is the fact that I would love to see the audience be participatory. Oftentimes, you know, people feel it a little bit, you move in your seat, right? And that's beautiful. But I also need you to feel like if you want to stand up and clap and move about and sing about, then by all means, that's what you ought to do. This is an interactive genre of music. And so we want to interact with you and we want you to interact with us. Is that all right? Okay, good. So I'm going to have you um, practice on one thing, right? So when I say to the children, ya, yeah, ya, yeah, they answer me back. That's what's up. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. That's what's up. Oh, you're so good. Here we go. The next song is entitled, The Real Meaning of Christmas. <laughs> Tell me what Christmas means to you. How many 
this time, I would like to bring forward Dr. Tommy Tyler. Uh, Dr. Tyler actually was one of the directors of Children of the Gospel during its formative years. And so I am just elated in knowing that we have the opportunity to share the stage and for Dr. Tyler to work with us all year long. He probably didn't know that. Now he knows, all year long. Please welcome Dr. Tommy Tyler. Greetings, 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 greetings. It was one written, it one, in one place it was written, that to everything there is a season. Hmm. And a time for every purpose under the heaven. Isn't that good news during this Utah season? So would it not be appropriate that the kids would start telling us what this season was all about and what the reason was for it? Some come, come jam with us. Come jam with us. Come on. Come on.
Let's put our hands together and give a warm reception for the marvelous job for Hope Harden. Hope, raise your hand. She was our solo. Now, Jaden Postel and Jordan Holt have a story to tell us about a very special night as they come to the mics. They're going to tell us about a very special happening, the night that Christ was born. Tell us about it, choir.
as you might have guessed. That was Joy to the World by Joe Pace and the Colorado Mass Choir. Um, we're going to do two renditions of Silent Night. One is by the gospel artist Kirk Franklin, and then the other is the traditional, which we will sing it in English, German, and Spanish. So for all of you who speak other languages out there, Merry Christmas. It was a special night. The darkness was all over the earth. But then there was great silence. And they said it was a what kind of a night? A silence.
Ms. Samantha Rios and Ms. Sitlali Dawson. As I'm uh, looking at time, so what I would like to do is kind of switch over. I'm going to ask uh, Dr. Tyler to come back up. And we do these two traditional holiday pieces, Jingle Bell Rock, and it's the most wonderful time of the year. They're often requested, and so um, I know that they're quite familiar to you all. So here's yet another opportunity for you all to get up and participate and jingle your bells or whatever it is. You might have your keys, whatever sounds good. Okay, uh, Dr. Tyler, would you come on up?
Come on, will you give it up one more time for Dr. Tommy Tyler? Yes. I would love for us to sing to you our theme song that is off of the CD. It's the title of the CD, Why Do We Sing? And this was written by Gail Jones Murphy. And first, I would like to make sure that I do not forget my phenomenal band, and I tell them this as well. There's nothing better than having a group of people who can play so exceptionally well, and they look so good, too. <laughs> so, will you please thank you, Mr. Tony Walker, our music director, Mr. Hamilton Hayes on bass, and Mr. Tim Steele on drums. Why do we sing?
Thank you so much, thank you so much. For our last number, we're going to sing Emmanuel, written by Norman Hutchins, right? So this is real easy, real easy. So I want you to sing, not just stand, not just clap, not just dance, but now I need you to sing too. It's a fun song, easy words. Come let us adore him, worship before him. Emmanuel, 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 we worship you.
Thank you for joining us at Millennium Stage.